everybody. Welcome back to another edition of Cranking Out Crafts. My name's Shay Flo, and we're going to continue flower making today with paper. This is another cute little flower that you can make and embellish different things with. It's a different twist on a paper flower. Okay, we're gonna get started, and you want a patterned paper and maybe a solid, or you could do two patterned papers, totally up to you. I'm starting out with a four by four sheet of paper. Okay, and I'm gonna use the polka dot side. So I have that, and then we're gonna take our pink paper, and again, our two and a half inch punch, and I'm gonna punch five of these punches. I've got them all ready to go, right here. And I'm gonna first take my double-sided tape, love this double-sided tape, and peel it up. Put my center, um, this is the first part of the flower and I'm just gonna center it there. Next thing, I'm going to half one of the scallops, crease it, and then I'm going to half it again the other way. I'm gonna do this four times. And this is the top half of the flower. With all these folds, it's nice because it gives your flower some dimension. And three. And then we'll do one more. Okay. And then we'll use our double sided tape again. And you can just put your double sided tape on here and then lay your flower petals on top of it. So I'll just pull this off. And then I'm just going to set these right around. And you don't have to match up those scalloped edges but these are gonna kind of puff up a little bit and create a flower look. You can kind of see how that's going. And then this one, and this one. Okay, and now what we'll do is coordinating paper. So I have that green paper again, and I'm gonna use a one inch punch. Just punch that center out. And you can use, now I'm gonna use a glue dot because we want to give it a little bit of dimension and this is going to puff it up just a little bit. Let's put the glue dot right in the center. Ta-da! And then you could also add a little button. I'm just going to add a little button to this one. Put my glue dot on there. Add a button. Voila! Other things that you can do, you could cut out a little strip of paper and fold it into a ribbon. We carry these cute little tiny spring-loaded clothespins, and you could even just add that. Oops. Just kind of scoop it right on there too. Another little embellishment and a way to use your scrap paper. Okay, hope you enjoyed the session today and have fun crafting.